Well, hello, my fabulous friends. I hope you're doing well. Wow, I have the Wizard's Tarot on the table. I'm really enjoying working with this deck. Very profound, very profound. And I'm asking a, a question that I want the Wizards to answer. What is going to be the next big scandal in the royal family? Because I, for one, do not pretend that there won't be. <laughs> you know, when actually you think about it, between... The divorces of the Wales and the Yorks. And then, of course, well, there was the death of Diana, but I don't consider that a scandal. I mean, the divorces of the two boys, that was scandalous. And especially the Prince of Wales, because that um, had implications for the monarchy, for the, for the heir. I'm... You know, really, it was kind of quiet for a while. You know, for a long time, Margaret, <laughs> Princess Margaret, she was always up for a good scandal. Um, then, of course, you know, the divorces, that was a, a good scandal. And we haven't had, I mean, then there was Harry and Meghan. And then we, well, we had Andrew first, right? That was a big scandal with him and J.E. Uh, so there was a big scandal. Uh, we had a bit of a little speed bump there with Charles coming home with a shopping bag of cash. <laughs> a little bit of a scandal there. And then, of course, all the scandals of what Harry and Meghan are doing. So what, what is the next royal scandal we can, we can, we can have, what we can look forward to? <laughs> Something else to talk about besides... Uh, Harry and Megan, ready? I think they're ready. They're not, they don't want to meld anymore. Okay, what is the next big royal scandal going to be about? Okay. Wow, three of pentacles in reverse. An affair. An affair. Someone's going to, someone's having an affair. Seven of cups in reverse, but it will be gaslit, of course. Four of Swords in reverse. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. The moon upright. Look at the moon upright with the, the Seven of Cups. Knight of Wands. Well, who's the Knight of Wands? Megan. Are we going to hear... And I just... Uh, you know, I said, please, not Harry and Megan. Are we going to hear about an affair with Harry and Meghan? You know, this Four of Swords in reverse. If you've been here a while, the Four of Swords is the sick bed. And there's only two ways to get off the sick bed. Either on your feet or feet first. And it's in reverse here. So let's keep reading. But we're definitely going to be gaslit from the truth. It definitely has something to do with Meghan. Definitely. And an affair. An affair. And what's the sick bed here? Is she going to... Seven of Wands on top of the Seven of Cups. It's an ever-ending... It's a changing situation. Um, Ten of Swords in reverse on the Four of Swords. Guys, 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 guys. Page of Wands in reverse. This is really bad news. Now, it involves Megan. It involves a, an affair. It's going to be really bad news. Really, It's going to be the ending of somebody. Somebody here is going to hit rock bottom. But... They'll have, they'll be def six of wands in reverse. Big, big loser. Big loser. Five of cups, deep, deep depression. Ten of pentacles. It's going to rock the family. Could involve an inheritance. We could be, we could be looking at a death here. We actually could be looking at a death here. Doesn't really show me whose, but has something to do with Megan having an affair 
She's the only court card that showed up. It's her. We don't even have a major arcana of anybody. And Ten of Pentacles, it's, well, so it does something to the royal family. Well, we asked. Thank you, cards. We asked you about the royal family. It could involve intergenerational. So maybe the cards are trying to tell me. And also Ten of Pentacles is inheritance, legacy. But it's upright on this Five of Cups and Six of Wands in reverse. Somebody loses and is very depressed. And if, and if, well, it'll affect the whole family, intergenerational. It'll, it'll affect the legacy of the family. It'll be involving an inheritance. Nine of Wands in reverse. Wow. Lots of embarrassment. Lots of embarrassment, lots of embarrassment and struggle and battle and wow, the sun. <laughs> three of pentacles in reverse, three of cups in reverse. The hanged man in reverse, ace of pentacles in reverse. Now, is the sun the S-O-N? Because I don't see anything good about any of these. If you're new here, and I have so many new subscribers, and or maybe this is uh, the first time you're watching one of my videos, you're a longtime viewer, sometimes I, I um, reverse things. So like if I'm, if I'm telling somebody a phone number, if I want to say 5-3, I say 3-5. If I'm trying to tell my husband turn left here, I'll say turn right. Uh, and I and so when when I say a word wrong or when I reverse a card, so if I say, oh, the three of cups upright, I know exactly it's in reverse. Or if I say three of cups, <laughs> but I know everyone's going, oh, it's three of pentacles, it's three of pentacles. I have a disconnect between what I'm seeing, my brain, and what, what comes out my mouth. It's a just a mild form of dyslexia. So that's what I've done here. And and also was a foreshadowing that the three of cups in reverse was going to show up. Sometimes that happens as well. Um, this affair is definitely going to release someone. I'm going to say the next big scandal is someone's going to be, uh, an affair is going to come to light. An affair is going to come to light. It has something to do with Megan. We still don't have another court card on here or major arcana indicating who else it is. But there's definitely a lot of struggles here and releases the hanged man. This affair releases the hanged man, costing a lot of money. Now we have a King of Wands in reverse. Ace of Cups in reverse. Wow. Lots of money, lots of tears, rivers and rivers and rivers of tears. Eight of Cups and Three of Wands in reverse. Lots of threes here. Queen of Cups upright. I think this King of Wands. Hear me out. Get your tinfoil hats on. Give them a good adjustment. Make sure they're on good and tight. I wonder if Megan is going to be involved in the death of her lover. That would be a huge scandal. And the reason I'm saying that is because the Ten of Pentacles is upright. So I'm not sure that it's going to, if this was in reverse, I'd say, oh yeah, the family's going to fall apart over this. But it's upright. And we don't have a King of Wands in the royal family. We don't have an Aries, Leo, or Sagittarius male. So I'm wondering if this will, if she gets caught, maybe she's with somebody and they have a heart attack or something. I'm not saying, I'm not at all saying that she is a murderer or anything, but just maybe 
or maybe he passes away and leaves her a big chunk of money and it becomes very sensationalized. But somehow the the royal family itself is upright, is upright. So I think it's only going to affect, I mean, she's a, it'll affect the royal family by association. I think, or I wonder here too, if it affects Camilla in some way. Two of Wands, because we have the Queen of Cups here. The magician in reverse. Boy, we sure get the magician in reverse when it comes to Megan a lot, eh? Black magic. Did I say that out loud? Page of Cups in reverse. Ace of Swords in reverse. Justice in reverse. I think there's going to be the next big scandal. is going to be something to do with the law. It's going to be something to do with the death of someone. And it's going to involve Megan. And somehow it's going to involve Camilla. I just want to quickly ask, because Camilla and... Clarify who this Queen of Cups is, please. Clarify who this Queen of Cups is, because you know who I'm seeing? Eugenie. But yet she's in Aries, but that doesn't mean like her moon or... Um, Like, look at that. Like, I'm just, I'm really seeing Eugenie. Eugenie? Eugenie? Please clarify. Who's this Queen of Cups, please? Please clarify. Who's this Queen of Cups, please? King of Cups in reverse. It is Camilla. How is Camilla involved? Look, at these cards are crazy good. Hey, like, who is this? Oh, this is married to the King of Cups in reverse. Uh, okay, well, who's, thank you for that. Thank you, cards. Who's the, who's the King of Wands, please? Who's the King of Wands? Who's the King of Wands? And why, why does this involve Camilla and Charles? Who's the King of Wands, please? Who's the King of Wands, please? Who's the King of Wands? King of Swords in reverse. That's my William card. And he is a Sagittarius rising. So he would be the King of Wands. And what about... What about Charles and Camilla and William? What about them that Megan is involved? What about them? What about them? Clarify, please. Clarify, please. And what about... Clarify. Clarify. Queen of... Oh, my God. Catherine. Okay, Catherine, William, <laughs> Charles, Camilla, what's going on? What's going on? What's going on? One card. Give us a clue. What is this all about? Don't be vague. One card. There it is. Popped out. Two of Cups. An agreement between somebody. An agreement between somebody. Interesting. Both women showed upright. Both men showed in reverse. What's the agreement? What's the agreement? What's the agreement, please? What's the agreement, please? What's the agreement? The fool in reverse. Some kind of foolish agreement. 
Maybe it does involve the whole royal family. Page of Swords. Something that's been published. They foolishly released or foolishly published let's just ask a yes or no does this involve a death 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 upright positive reversals negative does this involve a death no Knight of Pentacles, it involves Harry. Something to do with Harry. Clock agrees with me. Man, what are we digging up here? So now we have all the players on the tarot table. Is this scandal true? Is this scandal, is it going to be true? Is this scandal true? Is this scandal true? Is this scandal going to be true, false, or will it be false? Will it be public relations? Is this scandal true? Is this scandal true? Is this scandal, well, I don't wanna be shuffled anymore. Before we move on, I just wanna let you know, this has nothing to do with the previous, um, suggestion and fake news that Catherine died and there's a, uh, what's it called? A clone because she's up right here. So please ignore that all of that other stuff that went on. We're looking at what's the next one. So I'm, these are cards are not confirming what went on. I just want to point that out. She's upright. She's here. She's alive on the earth plane with us. Look at this is actually looks like Catherine with that long, beautiful hair. So I thought that was interesting. That video was done outside, just like the Queen of Pentacles would have. The only thing that was missing was a little rabbit. Okay. Will there be any truth to this scandal? Wow, look, at you see that cut? The devil in reverse. No, not at all. Not at all. The magician in reverse. This will be trickster. This will be sleight of hand. No. So this is going to be a made up scandal by guess who? By Megan, allegedly, for entertainment purposes only. Is this going to be a scandal of an affair? Did I? Is this going to be? Look at that. The devil in reverse. It's going to take the royal family, even though it's a lie, the devil, because the devil lies, even though it's a lie, it's going to stick. Just like how, you know, was Diana murdered sticks to the royal family. And no matter what they say or do, they just can't shake that. This is going to be the same thing, whatever this scandal is. Is this an affair? Is this the upright positive reversals negative? Is this about an affair? Is this about an affair? Is this about an affair? Queen of Swords. Might be about Sophie and or um, Sarah. Yeah, they both have S names and they're, they're Queen of Swords. They're both Queen of Swords. But Sarah is the divorced one. Um... Uh, well, that's a yes. We told the cards upright. Yes. Reversals. No. Might be an affair with one of the men. Because remember, I said both men are in reverse and the women are upright. Here we have another queen who's upright. It might be a scandalous. We might see something again about um, affairs going on uh, with another woman with, with the men. With one of the men. Maybe both. I don't know. Whatever Megan can come up with. 
in her goofy little brain. So yes, it'll be an about an affair. And oh, remember I did that reading and Megan was going to say that Catherine and Harry had an affair on William When the divorce is going through, she's going to throw out all these kind of bombs. Yeah, it's, there, it's going to be an about an affair or a divorce or something. I wonder if we're going to hear like Sarah and Andrew really aren't divorced. And that's why they've been together this whole time. Right? That would be scandalous. Okay. Well, that's as far as I'm going to dig. Uh, we do know that this is, well, the cards have said no. We got the devil in reverse. It's it's a lie. The devil lies, so it's a lie. But it's going to be impossible to shake. And just like the lies about that, you know, Catherine was beaten to death and then, you know, a clone had to come in and all of those lies, you know, some people still believe that. Some people actually believe that she is AI or she's a clone or like it's it just it blows my mind. Like, um, yeah, no, <laughs> that's uh, garbage thinking, actually. Anyways, she's alive and well and here she is and uh, we'll see what happens if this is to. Um, if this is Charles or William is going to be the target or maybe both of them be the target. Maybe something's going to come out that Charles had an affair <laughs> and Diana's not William's mother. <laughs> <'Cause that's laughs> but you know what? That's just what some of those sugars would believe. Anyhow, anyhow. Uh, here we go. And I also want to say that this is going to happen. Um, we didn't see Harry anywhere or we saw the King of Pentacles in reverse, but we didn't see it as a loving relationship. I think this is going to happen when they're divorcing. I think there's going to be these kind of bombs being thrown out and this is going to be her truth or write a book or something uh, like that. All right. All right. Well, thank you very much for watching. Sure hope you appreciated this. I had fun doing it too. <laughs> thank you for your likes. Please take care, good care of yourself and we'll see you online. Bye for now. <laughs>